<clears throat> Hello and welcome to the guided meditation for the full moon of March 2024 and it's also a Monday so you get two for the price of one today um, and did you know that the full moon in March is also known as the worm moon yes because all, all the full moons have names and that's there are other names too I think there's the eagle moon the the pascal moon because it's the closest full moon to Easter which is always the Sunday after the full moon after the, the first full moon after the spring equinox which was last week so if you haven't already do go and check out our spring equinox meditation as well so um these ha have names because they were recognized by ancient like North American tribes and Europeans and all spiritual traditions recognize the significance of, of the full moon. It's something mysterious, something magical. And so that's why we always we always meditate and use that energy to uh, to set intentions um, to get clear on what those are. I mean, it, we're, a, we're a work in process as humans. We're, we're constantly evolving and things change. You know, probably what you wanted when you were a child, some things might still be the same, but, but probably other things ha have, have changed as you've grown older, matured, your interests change, your values change. And so it's important to take that time just to reflect and think, well, what, what is it that's true for me now? and recognize that it that nothing is set in stone nothing is permanent everything is constantly changing and evolving and if you follow me for a while you'll notice that even my youtube channel is changing and evolving and there's lots of exciting new things to come so um let's meditate now on the full moon take the opportunity of that energy i um it's been almost full for a couple of nights, and I think it's Saturday night, it looked gorgeous. And um, and I always feel that energy is quite strong around that time. And sometimes I, ha I have difficulty sleeping because it, it, it's like, it's not just because it's bright, but also the energy from it as well. So get yourself into a comfortable position, turn off any distractions, and when you're ready, Take a couple of deep breaths, and if you wish, you can close your eyes. I'm just listening to the sound of the earth. You want you can put your hands on your heart and feel the breath. I'm just connecting with yourself now in this meditation. When we come into the present moment connecting with our true selves our divine essence who we really are there's nowhere to go and there's nothing else to do being here in the here and now. Just allowing your body to relax, letting the energy settle. 
letting thoughts carry on in the background. And if there are any sounds in your environment, just let them come and go without judging them, wishing they weren't there. The goal is that we're not letting anything disturb our inner peace. And we notice when it does and we come back to the present by focusing on the breath. The breath that gives us life, enables our body to move through this life life force, that prana. What's present in your experience now? Feeling a sense of spaciousness, openness. And if you want, you can visualize the moon. Feeling its light entering your third eye. all-knowing part of you that already knows what your purpose is, why you're here. And knows your true essence. You are a divine being, your pure love. And if your mind wanders off, gets caught up in thinking, come back to the breath, feeling the support under your body.
feeling more relaxed, more peaceful, more open with each out breath. And breathing in more peace with each in breath. And now, just let your body be completely at peace, accepting fully whatever's going on for you presently, without trying to push anything away, just allowing the thoughts to come and go without judgment. Any bodily sensations, feelings, emotions, sounds and other sensory experiences. And then we take this with us as we go throughout the day to become calmer, kinder, less judgmental and less reactive, not only towards ourselves, but also towards others and making a positive difference in the world together. Remember, your heart knows your true gifts and your purpose in this life, which might be just to simply sit and be and let your calm centred presence radiate out into the rest of the world, having a beneficial effect on everybody that you come into contact with. So thank you again for meditating with me today. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And if you enjoy these guided meditations, please buy me a cup of tea to support my work. The link is in the comments box, the comments, the description box below. And um, I will see you again very soon. If you wish, you can spend some time now to do some journaling. Um, if anything came up for you, during that meditation, you might want to journal on it or just journal anyway. <laughs> and um, in the meantime, bef before the next time, take care, go well and lots of love.